This is the book of Zechariah 13 and verse 8. And it shall come to pass that in the land, saith the Lord, two parts therein shall be cut off and die, but the third part shall be left therein. And I will bring the third part through the fire and will refine them as silver is refined and I will try them as gold is tried is then then they shall call on my name and I will hear them and I will say it is my people and they shall say the Lord is my power I want to give all praises unto Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai by Hashem Rekal Kadash double honor to the apostles and elders of the millstone shall want to rather push this truth and sincerity all over the earth and uh just want to get into this real quick about how there's going to be a remnant and that's what this this whole thing is about right now <clears throat> on, on this side this truth is for the elect the elect is going to understand this truth the the complete full understanding of the truth not just some of it and everything they're going to understand it and they're going to when they hear the this word being preached or whatever the case however you come in is going to draw them because the scriptures say it says uh my sheep hear my voice so those are people that's going to be drawn to this word that's going to do it that wants to to uh get more into it learn about it and then eventually start uh doing the works man and the remnant is only going to be the people that's going to make it out here which is going to be the elect not everybody, man. Not everybody of the house, even though it's the Lord's people. They're just not his people on this side because they're going to be in the kingdom. They're still going to have the part of the promises and all the other stuff. But <clears throat> right now, we're only dealing with the elect. We're only looking for the elect. We only care about the elect because everybody's not going to repent. Everybody's not going to get this truth. So that, that's the whole, that's the, <clears throat> the purpose of the ministry right now. It's not to be involved with all the other Israelites, the niggas and the two thirds <clears throat> that want to stay in Babylon and want to want to rap and do this and do that, man. So it's only about the remnant, and everybody's not gonna understand the truth. Because if it, it, it was meant to be, if we were supposed to be here trying to wake up all Israel. Do you know how long we're gonna be here trying to convince everybody? Israelites to convince, <laughs> try to try to preach. And tell them that we're the chosen people of the most. I will be here forever, man. I say we get every. I say we get all the Jakes, and it'll be that one Jake that want to be stuck in Egyptology or the the Black Conscious community and whatever, wherever, man. That's Jake, man. So we we there's no way that we will be able to do this and try to wake up everybody, man. So let's get this Romans eleven and verse seven. What then Israel have not obtained which he seeketh for, but the election hath obtained it. And the rest were blinded. As, according as it is written, the Most High have given them the spirit of slumber, eyes that they should not see, and ears they should not hear unto this day. So the, it's like it, the Most High puts <clears throat> the spiritual blockers on people. The Most High brings people into this thing. So people also say, oh, I'm, I'm waking up sheep, I'm doing this. You're not doing any of that, man. You're not you're not waking anybody up because you don't you to be in the truth. <clears throat> not the other way around. It's like these people who are to be trying to choose, choose to save his own personal savior. I came to him and he and he did this and all no, no man. No. So <clears throat> that shows you that everybody one is not gonna get it. And just like the, the scripture in Zechariah in uh, the thirteenth chapter said, what did it say? It said two parts there and should be cut off and die. Two thirds of our people <clears throat> are gonna cut off, be cut off and die, man. That's what's gonna happen. It's all about the remnant, man. It says like the remnant is gonna be saved. So the people trying to wake up all Israel and do all this. Thing thinking we're gonna wake up, we here for all the Israel. No, we're not here for all Israel, man. We're not here for the niggas that want to stay here. If we keep doing wickedness and, and stay here, man. We can't, we can't bring them.
debate with you that it is. <laughs> What she wants to happen, man. Remnant should be saved. Didn't say all Israel. Didn't say everybody. Didn't say the whole nation. A remnant. Because why? Because two thirds is going to be cut off, man. This whole thing is about the elect. You're not here for nobody else. You're not here for. You're not here for your uncle, your, your your cousin, your cousin Tony. That wants to smoke cigarettes all day and do and do this, man. We're not here for him. That that does not does not understand it and getting the truth. We're not here for those people. We're not. So what you guys have to understand is. <clears throat> You're only here for the elect. And the best way to learn is by repetition, man. Keep telling you over and over because Israel doesn't. They're going on the chariots and they're going and they're going home, man. They're not here about to grab your uncle. <laughs> now. It's. It's uh, it's possible that uh, your family members might get delivered because of you or your wife or your, or your children or whatever the case <clears throat> may be. Not saying I'm not saying that's not possible, but as far as the two thirds, me and the two thirds, they're going to be the two thirds, man. All these celebrities, the rappers and all them, man, that's conformed to this world. They're, they're not they're not making it, man. They're not making it. You're not going to see Jay-Z on the chariot. <laughs> You're not gonna see you're not gonna see none of them, man. You're not. So let's keep going, man. Let's let's see the comparison of how many people's gonna be saved to the people that's not gonna be saved. Second address nine and verse nine. Then uh yeah, yeah, yeah. Nine verse nine. Then shall they be in pitiful case, which have which now have abused my ways, and they that have cast them away despitefully shall dwell in torments for such as in their life have not received benefits and have not known me. And they have loathed my law while they yet had liberty and when as yet place of repentance was open unto them, understood it not. But despising, who was it talking about, man? It's talking about the Israelites <clears throat> and two thirds. The same must know it after death by pain. And therefore, be, be thou not curious how the ungodly shall be punished, and when 
but inquire how the righteous shall be saved, whose the world is, and for whom the world is created. Then answered I and said, I have said before, and now do I and now do speak, and will speak it also hereafter that there be many more of them which perish than of them which shall be saved, like as a wave is greater than a drop. It's about the remnant, man. And you see the comparison? Like a wave is greater than a drop. You see this big, big tsunami wave coming in. And then you got just a little drop of water. Just a little droplet of water from that tsunami. <clears throat> That's going to be the comparison, man. When the stuff hits the fan, when this famine starts hitting, the pestilence really hit. When when martial law, Jacob's trouble, and all this stuff starts to take place, man. And in World War Three, it's going to be a mass amount of Jake dying, man. A mass. Why? <laughs> Let's go back up. It says... Verse 11, and they that have loathed my law while they yet had liberty and when as yet place of repentance was open unto them, understood it not, but despised it. What did what these two thirds? What are these niggas doing in Babylon? They despise repentance, man. They despise the book. They despise this stuff. They don't want to hear nothing, nothing about that. Nah, we, we have a river to repent, brother. We can do this later, brother. <clears throat> I'll come back and do it later, brother. <laughs> I can have any time. I have any time to do this, brother. Ock. No, man. You don't. So. <clears throat> let's get. Let's get this. John. 10 and verse 27. It says, my sheep hear my voice. And I know them and they follow me and I give unto them eternal life and they shall never perish. Neither shall any man pluck them out of my hand. So that's what's going to happen, man. The sheep, the sheep hears his voice, man. He. This word is going to resonate with your spirit to follow it, man, to get out, to dive into it, to get un, to get into it. That's what's going to happen. And the other two thirds, man, they <laughs> their deeds are evil. So that's why they don't understand. That's when you heard it. You probably more than likely when you heard it the first time, you probably was a little confused about what you was watching or whatever the case may be. And you just start watching more and more, and then you started getting, you start, you start hearing more, you start watching more videos, and you start to get under, then you start to fully like start to understand what's going on here. Like okay, okay, we Israelites, okay, okay, the Savior doesn't look like that. This is his real image, and then you start to understand more and more and more, and the Spirit keeps giving you more the farther you go into it. <clears throat> And the last one I'm going to get, and I'm going to end it, <clears throat> is this right here. Matthew 24. And verse 21. I'm sorry, 21. For then shall be great tribulation, such as was not since the beginning of the world to this time. No, no, ever shall be. And except those days be short. Why the days are be short? sake no for the elect sake the days are going to be shortened that's why because the elect is going to be the only people that made it out of here and if the days weren't short the elect wouldn't even make it out of here but for the elect sake for the chosen people's sake the chosen people out of the chosen those days are going to be shorter man that's why we're here we're here to wake up the elect so we can get out of here not try to wake up not try to wake up uncle <laughs> uncle fred man it's not going to happen. Two-thirds is going to be the two-thirds. And that's just something you've got to deal with in truth, whether it be your family members or not. You have to live, let die, and be okay with that, man. You understand that you have to work your own salvation out of this truth. <clears throat> You're in this truth. They're not, man. To understand that. So with that... I'm going to close up. I'm going to give all praise unto Yahweh. By Hashem Yahweh Shai. By Hashem Rekakadash. Double honor to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone. Shalom to you, hopeful elect out there. <clears throat> and uh, I'll catch you guys in another lesson.
شما